two blocks A and B having mass 4 kg and 8 kg respectively are connected by a string. If a force of 120 Newton is applied on 8 kg mass, the tension between A and B is. Makale question try it ogu. Yes, e question jayan ayaru trick ke nengga parnera. Simple trick ana. Rand body kal tamile or string away connecte yana gel. A string ke lada tension endu paranyal. Acceleration into mass behind. Acceleration nu paranyal sister tinde acceleration ayri kana. So e question le A nu B kum a daily or string ende ayaru tar tension endu paranyal. Tension is equal to acceleration of the system into mass behind. A string in the back of the mass is equal to the mass of the system. So, mass into A. That's why we consider the mass behind. So, acceleration of the system is equal to the force divided by total mass. So, applied force is 120. 120 divided by 8 plus 4. That will give 120 divided by 12. So, we will get 10 items in the system. So, tension is equal to the mass behind. 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 Similarly, this idea will be done with a question. You will be able to do it. Three blocks are connected as shown in the figure on a horizontal frictionless table and pulled to the right with a force 60 Newton. If M1 is 10 kg, M2 is 20 kg and M3 is 30 kg, the tension T2 is. So, M2 and M3 are equal to the tension of the string. That string is equal to the acceleration of the system into mass behind. Mass behind is M1 and M2 are string in the back of the mass. If you use this trick, if you use the force act in one direction, if you use one direction, if you use the force apply, we will use the mass behind. So, if you use the acceleration of the system, you can apply the force divided by total mass. Apply the force, 60 divided by total mass, 10 plus 20 plus 30, that will give 60 by 60, the value will be 1. So, acceleration of the system will be 1. 1 into mass behind. A string in the back of the mass, M1 and M2, so total mass of the system in the world, Behind the mass on the barnel, 10 plus 20, that will give 1 into 10 plus 20. So the answer will be 30 Newton.